I've got the um, toiletries box here if you want to pop your towels in. It's only one month to go until Perth nominee Pat Mullins begins her role to Uluru. We're in full training mode now and, and Terry's acting as coach for me, which is great. It's been, been really good. He's a bit of a hard Four, taskmaster. <laughs> five, six, seven. Work, work, work. Nope. He has a fitness background, Terry, so he's, he knows how to get me into shape. Three, two, one, go. We're doing 25 kilometres an hour. Mind your head, Dale, mind your head. Oh, that's good. great. Keep going. Which is right, quite, okay. quite fast in, in roll, rolling stop. circuits. 5.29. Oh, 5.29. Oh, excellent. Well, this is my training course that um, Terry's been working on for the last four days, and he's just finished it. As you can see, a range of different surfaces. We've got your marshland, your dirt road, your beach, um, your rainforest bed, corrugations, salt lake. We'll be doing a fair bit of salt lake rolling. We've got your dunes, billabong there with your gravel sort of edging, which is fantastic. And I do like to, what I do is I rush my face by the, um, the marshes there, the little things, and just see what that feels like on the face gets me familiar. A bit more of your mulch. Well, he's thought of everything and, and Terry's installed a rain simulator and show them Terry, just to make sure I'm ready in case the drought breaks. That's great. We'll roll underneath. It is all about communication. It's about understanding each other, and and we've come up with a range of signals which I'll be I'll be using as I'm rolling along, um, which Terry will be able to see from the support vehicle, and he'll be able to react accordingly. This is water. If I need water, two taps means I'm very thirsty, and Terry Terry responds and saves a lot of time, a lot of and uh, stops any chance of dehydration. Thanks. Um, another one is sultanas. Sultanas are my energy food while I'm rolling, and this is um, Sultanas. Haven't locked that one in yet, but uh, it's looking like a promising one. And um, yeah, so water. It's in, so he reacts instantaneously. Sweetheart. Like any sport, rolling has its risks. Even a suburban Perth street is a dangerous environment for an endurance roller. A gum nut's gone up my nose. Oh, is right? yeah, there's a gum nut up there. Oh, I did. I can see it. Oh, I should have known. I saw them on the road down there. A trip to the doctor confirmed that Pat did, in fact, have a gum nut wedged up her nose. Can you snort it out? Oh, now it hurts. You cannot expect not to run into trouble with these sorts of things. It's, um... You have your hiccups. The, the gum nut is, is well and truly lodged up my nose and the doctor said that it will work its way out over the next few days. He said just some light blowing will um, help it to, to come down. He said I can expect some, um, some minor headaches and it is pressing against my brain here. So he said there may be some twitching and I could become aggressive slightly. Come sit down, buddy. I'll be there in a sec, sweetie. All Saints is on. Yeah, I can see it in the reflection. Cup tea, be nice. If you're making. Why don't you get off that ass and make your own bloody tea for once? <laughs>